Hey, quite the chap here for Golfers RX. Since we're still indoors, let's take a look at a couple putting drills that we can use to smooth out our transition and solidify our contact. Just some basic fundamentals that we need for a better putting game. Doctor? 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 If you're like me and you're living in a winter wonderland right now, or, or maybe you have the ability to work on your golf game at home, now is a great time to bear down and work on some basic fundamentals to improve our game when it comes time to get out on the golf course. So here are two simple putting drills that you can do in the comfort of your own home, or, I mean, if you want to, if you can, you can take these to the golf course and work them on the putting green as well. A great way to get the spasms out of your putting stroke is by using a coin. Place a coin on the back of your putter and make your regular stroke. If the coin stays on, you have a nice smooth transition from your backswing to your forward swing. If the coin falls off at your transition, you may be putting more of a hit into your stroke as opposed to a swing. You can even perform this drill with a ball because the main focus here is the transition. The second drill in this video is about making solid contact with the ball. We want to work on stroking the middle of the ball with the middle of the putter face. Makes sense, right? But when we set up to the ball, you'll notice that the middle of the ball is a little higher on the face. So take a coin, place it behind the ball, and make your regular stroke without hitting the coin. This will force us to elevate the putter just enough to stroke the ball with the middle of the putter face. Use these drills at home, take them to the golf course, and you're going to develop a nice smooth, solid stroke. And if you're looking for just some more basic drills that you can use to improve your putting, here are four drills. Four super simple basic drills, they're going to solidify your putting a little bit more.